It's missing COVID-19 funds. And there's a focus today on Busia County. So this is why they're on the spot. They spent 103 million shillings without a work plan and a further 106 million shillings late expenditure. So totally that they need to explain is about 209 million shillings. They're explaining all this to the Senate Health Committee. So the Busia County government spent about 103 million shillings without a work plan in the fight against COVID-19, contrary to Public Finance Management Act. Appearing before the Senate Standing Committee on Health, Busia Governor Hospital Jamong was put on the spot to explain the anomaly. Loro Tieno has more. During the two-hour session, the Busia County team led by Governor Hospital Ojamong were tasked to lay bare their spending of the monies allocated to them, including 103 million shillings from the county's own kitty. Ojamong was at pains to explain how the money was spent without a work plan in controversy to Section 107 of the County Government Act of 2012. I must say that we shall take precautions. Whenever there are no emergencies, we shall always work on the government programs. But what happens when we have very critical situations? Very critical situations. Let us not live in Ivor Tower and believe that things just work out. In the PFM Act, the, how you use national allocation money for emergency, and also in the county government, I don't think you are an exception. You should have a framework of how to spend emergency funds. The committee further questioning the delay in spending another 106 million shillings conditional grant offered by the national government, which was disbursed to the county in May 2020 for emergency response to the COVID-19 pandemic. The county also came under fire over the award of tenders for the renovation of the COVID-19 isolation ward amounting to 11.9 million shillings to four companies belonging to the same director. Why, 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 why should this happen? And you know the way governments work. Why one director? With one director you give, there's no competitive bidding. Nobody else... Uh, Chair, we, we, we have established, I think maybe we shall need to provide that information that... Uh, uh, the information that they belong to one uh, one director is not uh, very accurate, sir. Uh, we have established that there are, there are different directors for these companies, like two of them. Two companies for one director, two companies for a different director. Earlier, the Moranga County representative was turned away by the committee who demanded that Governor Mwangi Wairia appears in person. 36 counties were flagged off to have lacked either work plans or procurement plans, with 23 counties spending money without approved budgets. The government had secured 214 billion shillings from various development partners to assist in combating COVID-19. Of this, counties received 7.7 .7 billion shillings, much of which was misused by the counties. Laura Otieno, Citizen TV.